Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Jermaine and today I'm back with a new video. Today I'm doing a perfume video. I haven't done one in I think over a year so I'm, I'm really excited about this this is one of my favorite topics to talk about perfume and I bought some amazing tubes and that is what I'm gonna share with you guys today I might also share you some other perfumes because it was my birthday in November and it's already like six months ago six or six five or six months but it was last year and then I also received some perfumes so I'm also gonna show you guys that and some perfumes I bought throughout the months but mainly the two perfumes that I bought from the uh, brand Latafa and uh, Riffs I think I think that's the name and another some some other ones but I'm really excited about this and I hope you guys will also drop some perfume names if there are any perfumes that you guys like and recommend and like I always say grab you something to drink or something to eat and then we're gonna begin I'm sorry, y'all. I just heard that song in a video and I, it's so catchy. But okay, as you guys can see, it's a, well, it's the same background. It's just me in another outfit, another hairdo, and I actually got on nails now because I filmed the video, the perfume video, but the audio wasn't good. So that's why I left the intro, but the rest of the video is new. I'm gonna get right in. I already put my perfumes that I wanna show you in a bag. And I'm gonna show you the perfumes that I really love. Um, a lot of them are, uh, are they called Arab perfume? You know the, you know what I mean, right? It's very popular now. A lot of people use these perfumes because they smell just like the real perfumes. These are dupes, by the way, that I'm gonna show you, but they smell just like the real perfumes. And for the people that follow me on TikTok, um, I have already talked about, or I, sh I shared two perfumes. No, I'm sorry, two room sprays and one perfume, but the room sprays smell just like the perfumes. And um, I was talking about the sprays smell just like the perfumes from Inizio, I believe that's the name, that's how I write it. But let me show you what I got. So the first perfume that I'm gonna show you actually came in the day that I filmed the intro and you know, the video. And this one is also, this one is called, let's see, Honor and Glory by La Tafa. And this one is a dupe from the Inizio perfume, the white one. I'll put the name and picture of the blue perfumes in the screen, but this is a dupe. And trust me, I, no, not trust me, let me tell you. When I got it in, I think I sprayed it one time and then I closed it again. I haven't used it the, after me uh, testing it, but now that I'm recording a video, I will actually take it out of the box and put it with the rest of his brothers and sisters. So you open it and like it's really cute. And then you pull it out. Yeah. So it's really in there. It was really, really safe. And this is the bottle. So it's white with gold. Gold on the sides as well. And the back is just white with the name Latava. The top is also gold, also with the logo and name of Latava. And oh, and the bottom is gold as well. It's, <laughs> let me tell you something. I smell this perfume in a big. I don't know how you call a store like that, but a big expensive store in Holland. And uh, I smelled the perfume and I fell in love immediately. I want, I, I fell in love with it so bad. I almost bought it, but then the lady told me the price and I said no, because I, I call myself the dupe queen. I will always find a good dupe of something that I like if it's too expensive or if I don't want to spend that much money on it. So I found a dupe of it and I love it. Um, I do believe that all the uh, initial perfumes are unisex, so this one is also unisex. Men use it, women use it. I love it. I love, I've grown to love 
um, unisex smells. That well, how do I say it? not unisex, but male perfume. I like them, but this one is a beautiful mixture of male and feminine scent. Like I just love it. It smells so good. And when I sprayed it, I'm sorry, I love it. When I sprayed it, the scent stayed on very long. I sprayed it on my hoodie and on my arm. And in the morning, it still smelled like the perfume. So this is a beautiful and good and cheap uh, uh, alternative. As you know, English is not my first language. But this is a good do for the initial one if you don't want to spend too much money. So I don't know how much it's going to cost in other people's countries. But this one I bought for, I believe, 30 euros. Or was it the best? I think around 30 euros, not more than 35 it really, it really smells good and the funny thing is this one is 100 ml and the real one that I saw in the store that they, they I saw the sizes the biggest one was 80 ml so this one is 100 ml so this is 20 ml more oh goodness so ladies gentlemen as well of course try this one out this is the white one from La Tafa honor and glory okay so these two room sprays oops, these two room sprays are also from la tapa these are actually also dupes of their perfume now i will say um oh i don't know if you can see this is the purple one i hope you guys can see it clearly and this is the black one now i will say that when i smell them in the store um in uh the, the, the expensive store I thought they were a little bit strong so I wanted to try the dupe too but they didn't have the perfume when I wanted to buy them on uh, the website I buy my other uh, Arab perfumes I would say Arab that, that's not the correct name I believe but I think you guys know what I mean but they ran out of they didn't have the perfume anymore so I purchased the room sprays and I must say the black the purple one it smells good but it's really strong I don't like even though I like the smell I don't think I would go purchase the bottle because it's I think it's too strong I think it's more for men and I just use this in my house because I do like the smell like I said so I use spray it in my house my car and stuff but I'm not gonna purchase the perfume but the black one though the black one is a 10 the black one smells so good this is really a nice scent for males for men but i like it too like i will i'm definitely gonna purchase the perfume this one you know i i think i have another dupe perfume of the black one from indie chill so i'm gonna finish that one but sorry my nose age but um this perfume this sorry this room spray and also the perfume they smell really good i wouldn't say me like ladies go grab it i would definitely recommend the men to get it but i can definitely if i purchase the perfume this one i can mix it with maybe a sweeter scent and then the 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 scent will like simmer down a little bit it's not as masculine if i use a sweeter smell but i really like this one and there's a trick i do if i cannot find a perfume if they don't send you little testers just buy the room spray you can never go wrong with room spray you can always use some room spray so ladies and gentlemen the purple one the black one are very nice i will say the purple one is more for men this one is definitely also a men's scent but ladies we can use this one too okay so i purchased some more perfumes from la tapa i think four more but this one is one that everybody was talking about it's the camera by la tava and this is a dupe of the killian's angel share and i love the perfume i love the original one but i love the dupe there are so many dupes but i didn't have this one yet so i bought it but i did have let me see this one the cocktail intense i think i showed this one in another perfume video of mine but this one is also a nice scent but I must say the Camera La Tava one smells a little bit stronger than the cocktail one. Let me smell again. Yeah, the, co the cocktail one is giving me a little bit more tobacco, but the Camera La Tava one, let me see. Yeah, this one is a little bit more sweet and I like that. I don't like too, I don't like the like when perfume smells too sweet. But I feel like the cocktail one, and it is called Intense, is more, I don't, didn't mean to flick you guys off, 
but I think I feel like this one is a little bit more spicy. I think men can will definitely like this one more. But this one I feel like is a real good unisex. It's sweet. It does have the spiciness and the tobacco like the original like the um, Angel Chef of Killian. But I really like this one. And I bought this one for was it 40 euros? Or less? No, I think less. I don't really remember I had this one for a while but I really like the perfume I like the bottle I think what's unique about it, like I do like a good dupe but I don't the, the bottle doesn't necessarily have to look exactly like the original ones because I don't know I feel like for some reason that is this gives off corny like why try to be this exact same no you're different so I like the bottle I also like this one this one is brown like the angel share but as you can see, the cap is a little bit smaller than the bottle, so I really like that. Was like like that about it, but the Killian dupe <laughs> camera is a really nice dupe. Um, longevity, I will say around six seven hours. The scent stays on for very long, not as long as your skin. Because when I spray perfume, I spray perfume on my clothes and on my skin, like here and behind my ears and my uh, wrist, but. I feel like it definitely stays on longer on your clothes and on your body, but of course, you know the trick, you can put some body lotion, Vaseline, or if you can find a, a body lotion that smells like the perfume, you make sure you put that on your body first and then you spray the perfume and then the scent does stay on longer. But for a dupe, I think this one really does the trick. It really does the work and I like it and I give this one a, I'm gonna say nine. Let's see what else I have in my bag. Got it. Okay, so these two perfumes, <laughs> these are also from Latafa, Yara, and they have, I think, four or five different colors, pink, orange, green, red, and black. I don't know if there are any more colors, but those are the colors that I know of. But this perfume, I think last year it really became popular among social media, I mean, social media people, among uh, influencers, you know, YouTubers and stuff. But I had this perfume, I, I bought this one in 2022, or was it last year too? I don't know, but I feel like I have it for a long time. Let me just, I'm, I mean, I'm gonna be really, 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 really honest. The scent is nice, okay? It smells good, it's nice and sweet, but it's not mind blowing to me. I like it, it smells, it kind of smells like yogurt to me and roses, but it's not like, oh wow, I'm so happy, I'm so happy, oh. It's not blowing me away. Some, I feel, I do feel like some people were really overreacting when they were like, this is the best perfume ever. Buy it on a TikTok shop. Don't, you don't need to do that. I bought this one in Egypt. I did, I will be honest with you, I did buy it because a lot of people were talking about it because I saw a YouTube video of, uh, I think a girl who lives in Dubai and when she was promoting it or talking about a perfume, she was, so positive about it that I was like, oh, I need to try it. And when I smelled it in the store, I liked it. I remember really liking it, but I wasn't like, oh yeah. So I don't really understand the hype behind it. It smells good, but it's not, it's not mind blowing again. And this one is not that expensive. I think online you can buy them for $20. At least this one you can buy for 20 euros. So I'm sure you can buy it around two, between 20 and $30 or wherever currency you have but it's not expensive it smells good but it's not that amazing i will definitely give it a nice i'll give it a seven but it's not it's not a, a, a nine or a ten same goes for the orange one i do like this one sorry wait no i like the pink one better this one smells good too but i have to be honest to me it smells very cheap it smells like coconut and mango and plastic to me. I don't know how to explain it. Wait. No, I take back my words. I like this one better than the pink one. It smells good. I, when I smelled the, the bottle, it wasn't a mind blown, but no, I like this one. I like this one. It dries down nicely. It smells really good. Like I said, mango, coconut, and then. I don't know what the third ingredient is, but this one I like better than the uh, 
brass one. Pink one. I will give this a, a eight. I will give this an eight. But I do think you can combine this with another perfume. You can, of course have different combinations with your perfume but i do think that if you spray this one with another either sweet perfume or maybe a masculine perfume like one of the initial dupes the combination is gonna be fire i will definitely try it out tomorrow let me go in my goodie bag again y'all hear that okay i have two more dupes this is the Asda astaf astaf i believe i'm a read el arab arab I don't know how you pronounce this. I don't know if you guys have seen this bottle before. I think you also have them in, you also have this one in pink and in black, but I have this one. I really like this one. This one I also purchased when I was in Egypt. Vlog coming soon, by the way. But I really like this one. This one reminds me of the one from Lotion Gabbana, the blue one. What's it called? Something with blue, but it kind of reminds me of that one with a another scent i don't know i don't have no idea what the notes are in this perfume but all i know is it smells good baby and the bottle is nice like it's soft the, the red part is soft and then you have the gold it's the cat like i like it and this one i would definitely give a nine it's chic i don't know if this is also unisex i think so most of the arab perfumes are unisex but i know that i use it but men you can also try it but ladies definitely check this one out if you can see that asda i'll put the name in the screen so you can really see it because i don't know if you can see it on the screen and this one is not from latava this is belaya belaya i have no idea how you pronounce this but this bottle is very nice it's also a dupe of another perfume i forgot which what the name is of the original one but I actually got the wrong bottle. So you have the this one with gold, but I wanted the one that was all black. But I discovered that they gave me the wrong one when I got home because I was, when I was in the store and I smelled the black one, I didn't see that the box was different. So that's my mistake. I would definitely purchase the black one when I am in the store again. But this one, it actually smells just like the Rose Gourmand perfume from uh, Zara. And Mm, smells good and um it's like montel montel one of the montel perfumes hold on let me check it guys. let me check it for you guys the montel roses musk i think that is the dupe oh that is the real perfume and this is the dupe of that perfume but yeah it, it smells good I, I must say i have the the perfume that i have from zara it smells just like it and i've used in the when i first purchased it i used it so much so when I smell it now, it kind of gives me a headache. Not mad at it. I can still mix it with another perfume. But when I have the black one, I will definitely show you guys that one. And I will make sure I will know what uh, the original perfume that one is. But this one is nice too. You know, even though I've used it before, I smell it so many times. I will still give this perfume an 8. Because the, the scent is very, very nice. So, you see that? And I do have a little... <laughs> thing that i should definitely stop doing but i tend to buy perfumes sometimes because the bottles are nice i like this bottle i really do it's so different like you see that and then you just you just get on it i really like that i really do and you know the bonus no the bonus thing is the bottle being nice of course the scent has to be good but this just happened to be both nice bottle good scent whoa of course i'm gonna buy it Okay guys, this was part one of my dupe perfume collection. Tomorrow I will upload part two because otherwise this video would be too long. But I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!